Hello everyone, in this video, I am going to share how to prepare red coconut chutney restaurant style, hot and spicy that goes great with idli, dosa, vadas like, medhu vadas, dal vadas, etc. I am using fresh coconut for this receipt for which I am using a medium sized coconut. Use the white edible part to prepare the chutney. I am simply scraping through the outer hard shell and taking out the edible part of the coconut. For an extra smoother texture, you may also use grated coconuts as well. Chop these up into smaller pieces to help grind these well. Find out the amount of ingredients that I have used in the description link below. To prepare this coconut chutney, I have also soaked 12 to 15 red chilies, small and medium, mixed sizes in some water for about 4 hours before started to prepare this chutney. If you have no time to soak these, then simply boil red chilies for 10 to 12 minutes and it should be good to use. Into a frying pan, dry roast chana dal that is called Bengal gram in English. Saute in low flame for a few minutes. As you see, these are browned in color now and also turn aromatic at this point. Simply turn off the flame and keep it aside for later use. Into a grinder, take 3 tablespoons of cashews. Add the dry roasted chana dal that we kept aside. Add coriander leaves 3 tablespoons, cumin seeds 1 teaspoon, grated ginger 1 teaspoon and then add the coconut pieces into it. I am adding concentrated tamarind 1 tablespoon but you may use fresh tamarind as well. Now add the soaked red chilies. I am using some of its water to help grind these well and to adjust the consistency of the chutney. Add one green chili finely chopped salt to taste and 2 teaspoons of sugar. Grind these well. In between grinding, add some water as required. I am adding the leftover red chilli and the coconuts as well. Now as you see, it turns out as a smooth and soft chutney or sauce. Now next step is to prepare tadka for this chutney. To prepare tadka, into a frying pan, add some oil. Into it then add some mustard seeds. Then add some chana dal, 2 dry red chilies and quickly saute. Then add the curry leaves and a pinch of hing that is asafoetida. Give it a quick mix and then turn off the flame and then add a teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder for adding some color but this is completely optional. Quickly mix and add this tadka on top of our coconut chutney.
Mix these nicely and it's ready to use. Hope you like this receipt. Make sure to hit a like to the receipt and stay connected. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Thank you.